So recently I posted a video on the Dirty Epi Drip and I had a couple of people reach out to me about the flow rate wide open through an 18 gauge IV. And so I wanted to be a little bit more clear and explicit in what I meant by that. So the first thing I'm gonna tell you is that if you're going to do a Dirty Epi Drip, my preference is actually to not do it. I would rather do it through a pump or through push dose. It's more precise and you'll know exactly how much you're giving your patient. It should be the rare circumstance that you need a dirty epi drip. But if you're going to do it, my preference is through a micro drip setup, not just connected to a regular IV. And the reason for this is that through a micro drip setup, when you put the bag of fluid about 120 centimeters above the patient, your flow rate to gravity will be about 30 to 35 cc's per minute. If you connect this bag of fluid at about 120 to 130 centimeters above the patient to just the IV itself. This is going to get you closer to 100 cc's per minute. So just to be clear, be precise, use a pump and do push dose when possible. In the rare circumstance that you can't get or do either one of those things, if you're going to do a dirty epi drip, make sure you use a micro drip setup and not just connected directly to the IV because the difference will be anywhere from 35 cc's per minute all the way up to 100 cc's per minute. Let me know your thoughts in the comments.